I've had so many occasions when I've explained to people, you know, you on the very rare occasion when they listen, and you say to them, look, hear what I'm telling you. In Great Britain today, young Somali girls are having their genitals mutilated. If we speak against it, you call us racists. I am, my perspective is, I'm telling you in plain English, I want Somali girls to have the same protection from mutilation that white girls do. You don't. You're saying we ought to allow it in the, in the name of multiculturalism. And yet you are calling me a racist. You have decided to sacrifice a certain demographic of girls in the name of allowing multiculturalism to be practiced in the UK. How far do you get in terms of making them aware of the cognitive, cognitive no. dissonance of the words that they're uttering? You, you can't. You can't. It's a you. You can't. I mean, people are people are too afraid to agree with me in public. So we've got a sort of a um, an Orwellian two minutes hate thing. If anyone dares to dissent, even with a facial expression, they will be subject to verbal battery. You're a racist. You're a racist. You're a racist. You must understand. In the UK, you cannot be called a racist. It's life destroying just to be called it. You don't have to be it. You only have to be called it. Um, so people are terrified of that. Mm -hmm.